Well, it's November 28th, and today is my 39th birthday. And I just got home from work, and kind of like my dream day today is, uh, well, not necessarily be at work, but like to come home, I'm going to clean my car right now. I'm going to blow off the yard. I'm going to split some wood. I'm going to watch a movie with Jill later. Might even rent a movie, have a beer, maybe a whiskey, and uh, kind of call it a night. That's about it. So, um, yeah, it's my birthday today. <laughs> Very satisfied with the car clean. About 20 minutes, you can have your car looking fresh. Time to blow a little leaves. The night's winding down a little bit. I don't even know what time it is. Ran out of gas in my blower as I was blowing off the yard in the driveway, but actually was like in a perfect spot to finish, so. Just walking along the side of the driveway right now, just picking up some sticks that are in here. I started to blow this area out too. I got some trees over here that are bothering me that I think I'm gonna to start to take down tomorrow. I haven't started my chainsaw yet, I haven't used it. Uh, I think tomorrow might be the day. this for a birthday surprise. Listen. Oh! It's my birthday. I haven't heard the owls in probably two weeks. Oh! This is my buddy. We go back and forth with this call. Oh! <laughs> How cool is that? It's my birthday. I'm the owl. See, that's the owl singing me happy birthday. Before I go inside, I gotta clean the garage. I forgot about the garage. I actually really do this. This isn't just for the vlog. What's going on, babe? Hey, they have Wolfsmith Indian Pale Ale. Yeah, just, I'll go with the Pale Ale. Well, they're both Indian Pale Ale. What are the names again? Lunch, which I already got you one, and yeah. uh, Wolfsmith. Um, Let me get you one Lunch and one Wolfsmith. Yeah, that sounds great. Okay. Okay, thanks, bud. You're welcome. Bye. Bye. Jill's out getting me some beers for my birthday. I'd say my garage floor runs about a 13 on the stint meter. The bops just got home with my beers. What's up, eh? Hi. What do you got on you? <sighs> got the birthday boy his beers. Nice. And a very sad selection of seltzers. Ah, nuts. So What'd I you get, the, truly? I got the citrus pack. Yeah, oh, that's the least. So standard. Yeah, basic. Clean the garage. It looks great. Thank you. He cleans it every night. <laughs> and that probably sums up everything in the garage for tonight. Pretty happy with uh, the cleaning and the vacuuming and the readjusting of the wood. And Jill uh, reorganized uh, some shoes out here. And I took all the shoes off of uh, these racks right here and vacuumed every little individual space in there because I like it clean. So Jill did some Christmas decorating today. So we're going to go up and check that out. <laughs> birthday dinner about 10 minutes away got some steaks in the air fryer don't have any propane so we're air frying them but uh 
I've done this before, they're pretty darn good. Cracking a lunch from the main beer company. And Jill is cooking a very special pasta with, just go ahead and say it. Ginger coconut sauce. Ginger coconut sauce. <laughs> it's gonna be so good. And dinner is served. Jill ended up with the New York strip. I went with a little bit of a cheaper steak, but uh, I can guarantee it's gonna be good. Just finished up a fabulous dinner. Having my second beer of the night. And we're gonna make way down to the uh, lady lounge for a movie. Probably gonna rent one tonight. Cheers, y'all. Just about to head downstairs for a movie, but this one right here did an amazing job with the Christmas decor today, and we haven't seen it with the lights off yet. So we're gonna kill the lights right now, and we're gonna see what it looks like for the first time. Kill it, babe. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Guess I'm still learning the switches. Yep. Unbelievable. Oh, go get the other ones, come on. And three. Two, one. Ah, look at this beautiful area. Look at that. Is this spectacular or what? The what? See that? Oh, yeah. We got a little uh, reflection on the ceiling right there coming off the candle. It's beautiful. Nice job, babe. Thanks. It's 8 10. It's movie time. We're going to watch the uh, new Will Smith movie, Gemini Man. I'm excited for this one. Out. Does it get any more fitting for me? An owl and a camera. I think that I'm gonna put the owl right here. Tough to do with uh, one hand. Got a few things on my to-do list today. Number one is the battery in my Hyundai just died this morning. It's been going on me a little bit, so I went and got a new battery. We're gonna get that installed. Then I'm gonna run over to East Tatum to my dad's house and help him move a couple things. And then uh, hopefully just chill time for the rest of the day. Luckily, I've got some uh, mechanical skills. Should be able to whip this thing out of here and get it back in in, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes, maybe a half an hour. This toolkit right here, my dad and I found on the side of the road in Old Lime one time. We were going somewhere and it was like right by a stop sign. The person must have went through the stop sign and like slid out the back of a truck. It was scattered all over the road, so we picked it up. And this thing for the first time just saved my butt. If I didn't have this tool right here, I would have to go to the hardware store and grab some tools to get this battery out of the box. It's amazing when you have the right tools. Here we go, out with the old, in with the new. Battery, and you think she's gonna start? Shit, I, don't, I need the key, damn it. All right, here we go. Engine roar. <laughs> yes! About halfway home to my dad's house in East Tatum. Car's running good. Hope I'm not having an alternator issue, which would mean I'd have to take that out and change that because I really don't feel like doing that. But, you know, if you have to, you have to. Uh, anyway, real happy with the battery so far. Gonna probably take an owl walk over at dad's house. Gonna see what's over there. I don't know, got a little bit of a feeling after chatting with the owls at the house in East Lime last night. Maybe we'll find something in EH today. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it, I knew I had a feeling, I just had a feeling today. There's one of the owls that is like always in the same spot. It's gotta be one of the adults that I tracked all last year. Let's see if I can get it on video real quick before he flies away. He's looking right at me. Oh, he's moving, he's got wings moving. Let's see if I can get him on video quick. I just finished up at dad's house. 
uh, I ended up going inside and um, cutting my hair. I cut my hair when I go home. I bring my buzzer because my dad's got one of those mirrors that like folds out like that. So uh, yeah, check this out. Look at this do. Yeah. How good does that look? I brought my buzzer over there and I got it wet recently so it, it wouldn't work when I went to use it. So I had to use my dad's buzzer and there's not enough extensions on the side. So I gotta go buy a new buzzer and fix this mess. On the way to CVS over in East Lime, I was peeking through the trees and just like saw the moon coming up. Holy crap, it's gorgeous. There's like a reflection uh, on the water here, moon right there. Uh, let's zoom in on this bad boy a little bit. Nice little moon. Wow, is that beautiful or what? It's got such a nice little yellow, orangey glow to it. It's gorgeous. Just got home, got my new buzzer set. It's actually the same exact one that I had. Just gotta remember that I can't run this thing under water to clean it out because it's not waterproof. Anyway, I got a little mirror set up over here. We got this one here, we got this one here, and we are going to try to salvage this, <laughs> this disaster right now. I hope this goes good. Oh crap, I don't know if this is gonna work. Like the, the fade doesn't look right. I don't know if you can see it or not. Ugh, shoot, I might have to cut this very short. So I think the fade that I did at my dad's house went really nicely into the two on uh, my clipper number things here. And I'm gonna try to fade this to a five. This is gonna be a stretch, but. Not exactly what I was hoping for. Um, the fade's not exactly right, but we're gonna keep working it. And with that, I'm pretty happy with the haircut. I'll take it. It's not bad for uh, doing it on your bedroom floor type job and light really wasn't that good, but uh, okay, now's the part you've been waiting for. Now the thumbnail that you saw comes into play. Yes, I'm 39 years old and I still cut my hair with the Floby.